Hi guys, it's Mike. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I'm going to teach you how to color grade an image in Adobe Photoshop using the orange and teal look. So it's going to be a very short tutorial. I'll do it in about just three clicks and we'll have our image. So keep watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. So um, this is our before and this is our after. So basically what you are going to do here, I'm going to delete my background, my, I'm going to delete my the layer with the edit so that I start from the same level as you. So if this is our image, we are going to duplicate the background layer by right clicking on the mouse, duplicate the layer, and you can name it orange and teal look. Okay, so once you've done that, you can go ahead to the filter and camera row filter. So in this window, camera row filter, you'll have all these adjustments, but we are just going to ignore all of them. And we are going to come down here. We expand the calibration. So here we are going to do it like this. This is the orange and this is the teal so we have it there and we're going to say okay so i don't want the oranges on her skin tone so what i'm going to do i'm going to create a layer mask i'm going to click right here and i'm going to take the brush tool right here i'll i'll, I'll make sure the the brush hardness is at 0% and I'll increase the size of my brush so that it's big enough. Um, this one should be good enough for me. So I'm going to select the, I'll click here and I'll select the foreground color to be black and I'll say OK. So I'm going to paint over the skin, the parts where I don't want the the effect to be applied. So I'm just going to Okay, and then we are going to her hands. I'll reduce the size of my brush a little bit. Remember, if you, by mistake, you paint over the background, you can always change the foreground color to white. And you can rectify it. Uh, so you can see that this is our before and this is our after. You can always, if you don't want it to be this intense, you can always change the opacity. You can see, but for me, I like it when everything is extra. So if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. I'll be creating more content soon. Thank you very much.